welcome to my new home, the long-awaited house tour. Come on in. As you guys know, if you've been subscribed to my channel, I just recently moved from Los Angeles to San Diego. If you're new to my channel, what's up? So happy to have you here. Make sure that you hit the subscribe button and come on back. But let's get to the house tour. So here's the kitchen. Uh, one thing I absolutely loved about this apartment was all of the natural light that came in here and all of the open concept. Literally everything is so incredibly open and airy and spacious. Um, so, here's the kitchen. I have a pantry in here and lots of counter space, which I loved too. Um, so one thing that I didn't realize and that I didn't love um, was that the cabinets are very narrow and I found like it was really challenging to find one of those organizers to put your silverware in. So, I came up with my own silverware organizer that I absolutely love and think that it gives the kitchen a lot of character. They're just three little mason jars and then obviously I put my knives, spoons, and forks in each of the separate ones. And that was, I think, $9 from Home Goods. So if you guys have a Home Goods by you, you know how amazing that place is. Um, and then one thing I love about this neighborhood is that I have a farmer's market literally right outside my door every Saturday. And so I've made this promise to myself that every Saturday I'll hit the farmer's market and as my last stop on the way back, I'm gonna get myself some fresh flowers so that I always have fresh flowers in the house. And I think it just adds a nice little touch. This is one of my favorite things that I have in the house. This has been at my last three apartments, and I got this at Home Goods as well. Collect moments, not things. I don't need to elaborate on that. This giant spaceship is going to be gone next week, so please just, let's pretend that's not even there. Um, the California water is just, it's not drinkable. Uh, so I had this Culligan water filtration system installed and they did not tell me that it was gonna be like the size of a spaceship. So they're gonna be removing it and putting like an actual system that just comes up through the sink. And so yeah, this will be gone. Come on in, my living room. So this area here is supposed to be for a dining room table, but I'm actually really just been enjoying having this as like my selfie station. <laughs> Let's be real, like what's more important? Priorities. Um, I am going to be putting um, like a bench style table right here that is just narrow so that I do have somewhere to sit and eat because right now I've just been eating my meals on the couch or like leaning over the countertop. So I will be putting some sort of dining table here. If you guys have any suggestions or ideas for something that I could do that would be um, not take up too much space. And honestly, it's not just so I can take selfies. I honestly just think putting a giant dining room table right here would really close off the room. And I love just like keeping it very open. So welcome to the living room. Um, I actually did not intend for this place to be so girly, but it just, sort of happened. <laughs> um, I love like rose colors and rose golds and so that's sort of the theme that I went with. Um, the couch is from Living Spaces, throw pillows are from Target, and then most of the other like little odds and ends are from Home Goods or Target. Um, I'll be putting the links to where I got most of the major things in the description box. So if you guys have questions or want to buy things of your own, just check the description box first because they sh there should be links in there for mostly everything. Um, this was one thing I loved. Uh, it's just like a little blanket basket and it matched my pillows perfectly. I found that at Target as well. TV, TV stand, which I've literally turned on like twice since I moved here. Um, the cable box is not even <laughs> plugged in. So, oh, this, oh, I have to show you guys this. Okay, so these Sterilites, they, they did not come with the apartment. My dad came to visit last weekend, and if you watched my last video, you would have saw featured my papa in there. And we were sitting on the couch, and I was like, Dad, I wanna do something really cool with lights on the staircase. And he's like such a handyman and instantly just had this cool idea to do these, they're called Edison lights. And you can find them in like the outdoor patio section at most stores, these are from Target. And he literally, we went to Target and he got these up in like 30 minutes. And I think it just adds so much fun character to the house and especially at night you can kinda turn off the lights and just have the Edison lights and then you have the city lights of San Diego in the background too and it's just such a beautiful ambiance. So, moving out to the patio. 
So this was actually one of the things that sold me on the apartment. When I was looking at places, this was the third apartment that I looked at. And we walked in and the guy was showing me around and he walked over to the balcony and he was like, oh, and then you have these beautiful French doors. And I was like, can we do that again, French doors? <laughs> and I was just sold, like this is just everything. So come on out to my balcony. <laughs> Over there you have the harbor, and I literally come out here every single morning, read my devotionals, count my blessings, journal, and just express my serious gratitude for just being here and being in this moment. If you watched my uh, mo one of my more recent videos, I talked a lot about why I made the move from Los Angeles to San Diego, and a lot of it just had to do with my mental and emotional health, and just being here and just Embracing my surroundings um, really shows me that I made the right decision to move because I have never felt so at peace and um, I think it just shows you how you really need to reflect on your environment at all times and make sure that the people, not just the places, but the people around you and the things that you're doing are, you know, cultivating an experience and an atmosphere of happiness for you. Oh, this was my housewarming present from my mom and dad, my bistro set. Hello, mom and dad, I know you're watching this video. <laughs> this is one of my favorite little um, sections of the house too. I just thought that this was such a cute little decoration. The Base is from Home Goods. These little flowers are from Home Goods. This is from Target. And the frame is also from Home Goods. I love that sort of like rustic wood touch. Um, I have not put a picture in it yet, but that saying, I don't know if I will even put a picture in it. Be in love with every minute of your life. Stop. We have to recognize my housewarming gift from Randy Kennedy. I'm absolutely obsessed. Randy's actually filming this video right now, so Randy, why don't you tell YouTube where you got this, because I know you're going to ask. <laughs> I got this on Amazon. The link will be in the description box. It's so cute just to add a feminine touch to your sofa or use it as a rug. So I thought it fit perfectly. I think that, honestly, this pulled together the whole room. So, thanks, Randy. You're welcome. Let's go into the bathroom and then the bedroom. Oh. <clears throat> I couldn't, uh, I almost missed showing you guys one of my favorite pieces that I bought for this apartment. My gold and marble clock. You guys, this thing is so freaking beautiful. I don't even know if the video does it justice. Randy, is the video doing it justice? Uh, it's showing it pretty well, but no. It's, it's like so shiny and beautiful. It's so beautiful. Um, I got this from Ashley Furniture. I'll put the link in the description box. And it was like 70 bucks. And if you guys can really see good. how like large and just gorgeous this clock is, I really think that that was a really good price for it. So. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> into my bathroom. Shout out to Randy for, this was the final room that I had to decorate and I think I just felt like uninspired and didn't know what to do in this bathroom but I absolutely love it now. She helped me put the final touches on it so we went with like a teal and silver theme in here and I love all the colors in here. Everything is just bright and pretty. Obviously you guys get the idea that bright and pretty is just what I wanted in this entire house. <laughs> So I will link where everything is at, um, or where everything was from in the bathroom. So when I wasn't even planning these colors, I had already hung this photo behind the door, and I'll show you guys, it just literally matches so perfect. It did. And also from Home Goods. I'm a bargain shopper. <laughs> <laughs> Shower curtain is kind of just like a silver paisley. Um, it's got like a little bit of shimmer to it, also from Home Goods. And then, I have to show you guys, I just got this brand new scale. It's from Vanity Planet. And what I love about it is you can program in uh, your stats, like your height, your weight, um, and what it'll actually do is tell you your body fat and all of those, um, all of those statistics as well. Um, it's such an incredible scale for measuring progress and keeping track of your progress over time. So I will link that in the description box as well. And they actually gave me like a ridiculous coupon code too. So check that out. Going on into the bedroom. 
bedroom, also nice and bright. Honestly, another thing that really sold me on this apartment was just all of the natural light that came into it. Haven't done too much decorating in here yet, so this will be the final room to decorate, but I didn't want to hold off on the house tour any longer. This is one of my favorite things in the house. This was something that my parents got me for Christmas last year. It's a hand-drawn photo of us from a Cubs game. I think it was like the season opener that we went to, so obviously we were all like dressed super warm because it was freaking freezing. I remember it was snowing the entire game. It will snow until like literally April in Chicago. Any of my Midwest people, you get it. You get it. Feels why I moved here. Um, and then I do have like a couple of my trophies and medals. Most of them are still back home in Chicago, but I just kept the ones that were like most memorable for me, like when I won my pro card and then some of my top placings as a pro. And all I have also, I don't know where these accents come from, but um, the French doors also come out into the bedroom for a second balcony. And again, just a gorgeous view of downtown and then the more serene view of the water and the harbor on the right. <laughs> So most of my furniture in here is from Ashley Furniture. Um, the bed frame and headboard and the nightstands, matching dresser, they were all a set that I got from Ashley Furniture. Bedspread is from Target, actually. Another thing that sold me, huge walk-in closet doesn't look as huge now that I've completely filled it, but nice and big, lots of organization. I did like the little shelves on the bottom for my shoes. Those were just like cheap shelves that I got from Ikea. All right, so one thing that was um, like a must have when I was looking for places was a, either a second bedroom or somewhere where I could have an office. Um, I work from home and my work environment is really, really important to me. And when I was living in Los Angeles, um, Los Angeles is just so crazy expensive. I was living in a one bedroom paying close to what I'm paying now for this apartment and was working at like my island countertop every single day or going to a coffee shop. Um, and it just wasn't like a c conducive to like get work done. It definitely hindered my productivity levels. Um, so I really, really wanted a space that could be like a designated office. And then also to force me to have shut off time too, because when your workspace is the same as your home space, it's really hard to force yourself to have that shut off time. There were times where I would literally work until the moment I went to bed. Um, so this was definitely um, a an amazing feature for this apartment because it's a one bedroom plus a loft. And I thought, oh my gosh, what perf more perfect space to turn into an office. So come on up to my office. Plus, I got upstairs and I don't even have to go to the gym. <laughs> <laughs> but you're going to. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, so same kind of theme as downstairs, kind of. I really just love rose golds and just like bright colors. Um, so my desk is from, Ashley Furniture as well. I know you guys will probably ask where my laptop case is from. It was really cheap. I got it on Amazon. All of the different desk accessories, the rose gold desk accessories are from Amazon as well. My boss lady chair from Ashley Furniture. Um, and then my lamp, my little gold and marble lamp. I got that from Target. Uh, this is something that I got from Home Goods. I'm super excited. I'm gonna hang it right here and it comes with like a bunch of other little paper clips to just hang photos of Randy Kennedy on. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Maybe some of my boyfriend and family too. You never know. <laughs> um, Best friends come first. Absolutely. <laughs> and then uh, I'm just really big. I love just like sayings that resonate with me and like speak to my heart. And so this one says, little girls with dreams become women with vision. Absolutely love that. Love that. And then this is one I've had for years. Anything is possible if you have the courage to make it happen. Being a freaking action taker. <laughs> and of course, false lady. <laughs> <laughs> One thing I absolutely love, and it's like hard to even like express the feels I get when I'm sitting here working, is I literally have a view of the water. Like I, I'm working here, 
and there's the water. <laughs> Nothing feels more just inspirational to me and just helps ground me, helps me feel centered and just puts me at peace. Um, my just my inspiration levels, my productivity levels have been like on 100 since I moved here about a week and a half ago and so God, it's so good. <laughs> so beautiful. So really quickly, before I wrap up the video, because I'm sure you guys will ask, the end tables and the coffee tables were a set also from Ashley Furniture. Most of my major pieces of furniture in here are from either Ashley Furniture or Living Spaces. The TV stand is from Living Spaces. And then those two uh, pictures on the wall, the wall art, those are from Ashley Furniture. The mirror is from Home Goods. I got that mirror for like 70 bucks. Like, it's a huge mirror, so crazy good deal. But this is it, you guys. Thank you so much. <laughs> Amazon. All right, guys, that's gonna conclude the house tour. I hope that you love it as much as I do. Definitely open to some suggestions for this dining room area, so make sure you leave me a comment below if you have any ideas. Everything will be in the description box if you see things as you're watching the video tour that are not in the description box, just leave me a comment below and give this video a thumbs up. It really helps if you show your support. Subscribe on your way out and I'll catch you guys in the next video.